G'day guys, Jason and Nale here from Prospect in the Alpine and today we've come back down to the creek with no gold. To check on the water levels after the rain we've had and just to finish off a spot that I was test panning the other day. It's good to see there's plenty of water in the main creek just here. And this side channel here finally flowing after all the rain we've had. We've been waiting so long for this to flow again. Alright guys. This little spot here was a spot I had a bit of a test pan in the other day before the rain and I got one little nice speck out of it so I thought I might as well come back and try and move some of those rocks out of the way and get a little bit deeper down just to see what's down there because curiosity is a killer and I've been looking at it every time I come down and looking at it here when the area was flooded it looks like it might have been a little bit of a dropout point for some of those big rocks so if they've been dropping out of it I wonder what else has with the water feeling pretty cold and icy and a half decent pile of rocks there to go through, I decided to set up the high banker. That way I'd be able to, you know, try and get through this pile today. Because as you can see there, it's a half decent pile. Some good decent sized rocks in it too. I could tell you my back was feeling it by the end of that. When I stopped to have a bit of a break, I thought I'd have a look in the high banker as you do, just to see what I could see. And what do you know, we found a bit of picky. Always good to see these. Pity there was only that one though. But I always love seeing them in the top mat. Always put a smile on my face. So this is what we ended up with out of that little bit of a mound there, I suppose. Not a bad effort, so pretty happy with that. Now back down here for day two, I noticed this area on the way out yesterday. Though. And it looks like a nice little bit of clay with some decent river gravels through it. Which down here is usually a pretty good sign. And then this little bit right next to it looks like it hasn't been dug for a little while so without further ado I decided to put the high banker together again to try and get through some of the dirt. Because as we all know it is a numbers game the more dirt you can move the better. And if you couldn't tell I absolutely love high banking it's one of my favourite things to do. Oh and by the way guys I need to thank each and every one of my followers because we finally hit the 1000. Yay! Thank you very much guys. It is much appreciated and without you guys I couldn't do all these awesome videos. So as promised in my next video we will be doing a giveaway of the pay dirt that I find in that video. So keep your eyes out for that next video where I will tell you how you can win. So good luck to you all. Alright this is the end result for the digging for the day. And yes guys I did fill my hole. Always remember to fill your holes. And this was the result for about three hours of high banking. Very bloody happy with this.